Entertainment TV. Today is the 2nd of February uh, 2023. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow. So guys, uh, South Africa has banned Zimbabwean trains from its territory, stating that the old wagons raise a high risk of derailment. The ban was confirmed by National Railways of Zimbabwe NRS General Manager Ms. Respina Zinyanduko Monday while answering questions before Parliament's Transport Portfolio Committee. Zianduko said the challenge about our failure to send our wagons to South Africa is that our wagons are old. Because the wagons are old, SA does not want them on their rail lines because they say they are have a high risk of development because of their age. They do not want to risk damaging their tracks. If you look at other countries like DRC, Zambia, Botswana and Mozambique, our wagons are going all the way to these countries without any challenges. So the only challenge with SA is our wagons. They say if we buy new wagons, they will allow them into SA. Their wagons SA are actually coming into Zimbabwe because our wagons are substandard. NRZ is now using SA's wagons to carry goods to SA. Sinyanduko added that NRZ a railway system needed new wagons as most of its equipment had gone beyond its average lifespan of 40 years. She said of the 68 mainline locomotives, 14 of these were not working and the rest needed upgrading or replacement, Sinyanduko added. Most of them have outlived their 25 years lifespan. Wagons have also outlined their 40 year lifespan and most had gone beyond 60 years. Over the years, the company, which is wholly owned by the government, claimed to have entered into deals with some international companies, including Yapi Mekezi, a Turkish company, in a bid to, to recapitalize and modernize the nation's railway system. There's no notable transformation uh, to date. Yes, uh, NRZ have um, signed so many deals with so many companies, and I think the mega deals, my mega deals. The government needs to privatize NRZ. Yes, because you will remember that our country could run companies. Our politicians don't be any good by the business. And but anyway, we're gonna be keeping you guys up to date with the latest here. And uh, I don't blame SA for burning those wagons, uh, you know, because they are old. Like the wagons are from the museum. Yes, I can display since 1947. I can find from Umtali to uh, Ebulawayo whatsoever. Hey, but this is our na digi digi. I know. Uh, my wagons are I can't move farm as a good arrow, but then I started to attend the you know, um, Zimbabwe. So I feel like they need to decommission all of them. NRZ to tanga pass out and go to one. The Russia was what was the use of having that NRZ body repo at the moment if these guys um just sitting. Never train a woman 1914, 1913, 19. I don't know. Russia was what so hope that uh, the government will decommission all those wagons, all those trains to turn out to one, start afresh from zero. Yes, this is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Milan Entertainment TV. Put it all in the comment section. Remember to like, share, comment and follow. Bless up.